It's a mess. What is this? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to hop on here real quick and do a super quick Lush haul with you. I went to the mall yesterday, yeah yesterday, and I have their little Valentine's Day brochure right here so I can tell you the exact names of the products because sometimes when you buy from Lush, like you literally, like if you buy a bar of soap, like you get just the bar of soap, like there's no packaging, there's nothing that tells you the name or the scent or anything like that. So I grabbed this so that I could tell you guys what it was that is in each product. The one thing I wish I would have got and I didn't is the Rose Bombshell Bath Bomb. I love their bath bombs by the way. They're just like this compacted thing that you put in your bath and they just turn your baths colors and they smell good. Um, but yeah, I love Rose and I just didn't see that one so I didn't pick it up. But I did pick up the heart shaped one right here which is called Tisty Toasty Coconut what? Con coca what the heck does that word say? Con C O N C O C T. Con I don't even know what that means. A love potion in your bath with rose, precious orris root and romantic rosebud. So that one I did pick up and it's like hot pink. Look at this. Hot pink and there's a the little rosebud. It definitely smells like rose, which I appreciate. Mmm, it smells so good. It looks like they actually have quite a few that have rose scents right now. So they have the Rose Bombshell, the Tisty Toasty, and then Love Boat, which I didn't get. But it's like, looks like a boat right there. I did get the Whole lot of Love Bubble Rune. So they have these like bubble runes. They look like macaroons. I've had a bunch of them. I've had the rose one. Surprise, surprise. The yellow one that smells like pineapple. This one is the Whole lot of Love Bubble Rune. And it's shaped like a heart, which is so stinking cute. So this says, show your skin a whole lot of love with silky cocoa butter and romantic jasmine. I'm not usually a big jasmine scented fan, but I do really like the scent of this one. So here's what it looks like. You can see there's like glitter in the middle. Mm, it smells really super, super good. So these actually create bubbles in your bath. So it's like in replacement of bubble bath. Oh, it smells so good. And these are expensive. Like each of these products are like five to ten dollars each which seems ridiculous if you use this that's like a ten dollar bath you're taking so what I do is I usually break it in half or break it into fourths and I feel like that's plenty for me to get the scent and the effect of the bubble bar or whatever so just a tip for you guys because they are quite pricey the next thing I picked up was actually a bar of soap I have owned one of their bars of soap before and I really enjoyed it it just leaves your skin super soft and it's made with natural products which is always a good thing so their Valentine's Day one is called tunnel of love the full bar is actually like shaped like a heart and then they cut it up and you buy a piece of it but there's still see it's all wrapped up like this um, like the shape of a heart that goes down in the middle. So I'll show you guys right here. Look at how cute it is. Oh my God, it smells, it smells so good. And this one had like a brick imprint on the outside. Mm, it smells so good. So this one says, let love take you for a ride, perfumed with rose water, sweet wild orange and lime oil. So rose, orange and lime mixed together. Who would have thunk it, but it smells so good. The next thing I got is a bath oil. So they have solid bath oils that you put in the bath and then they melt and they turn into oil and they really hydrate your skin, which is perfect for this time of year because my skin is dying out here. But I got the Valentine's Day one, which is called polyamorous. I don't know, I don't know how to say that. Polyamorous, yeah, polyamorous. <laughs> Why do they have to make these names so difficult? It says, give your skin extra lovin' with a alluring violet absolute and skin softening butters. So I did pick that up. You can see it's making the bag all oily. But here's what it looks like. It's so pretty. It has like hearts on the top and then it's shaped like hearts. It smells really good. It doesn't smell as good as the others, but I do love the bath oils a lot. Two more things that I picked up. The first one is a lip scrub. I love Lush's lip scrubs. They're some of the best. You can eat them. I mean, I wouldn't recommend like opening the tub and eating it, but if a little bit gets in your mouth, it's totally fine. But this is the Valentine's Day one called The Kiss, and it's made with sugar, and this one has like little heart-shaped, 
actually you can see it better on the lid, little heart-shaped things in it as well, crystals in it. So it says, buff away dryness with this fruity scrub, then get ready to pucker up with the softest lips. They actually have a lip balm, here's the scrub, here's the balm, balm version of it that I was looking at, but it's really sparkly, and I'm not a fan of like sparkly lip balms, so I didn't pick that up, but I have used this, I used this today actually, so a little bit has been used works really well. And then last but not least is not a Valentine's Day product, but this is something that I try to pick up when I can. It is a pricey product, but it is well worth it, you guys. This is the Rose Argon Body Conditioner. <sighs> I have gone through, I don't even know how many tubs of this. Okay, why are you not opening? I was trying too hard, apparently. Um, here's what it looks like. I have gone through so, so, so many tubs of this. Oh my God. If you love rose-scented things, you will absolutely love this. It smells so good. It smells just like a fresh, clean, like real rose. It smells so good. But even the scent, like they have this in other scents. Sometimes they have seasonal versions of it. Like they had a snow fairy one for Christmas. The scent is great, but the actual product itself is so amazing. It's a body conditioner. So it's kind of like the in shower body lotions that are big right now. Lush did it first. Lush has had this product way before these in-shower body lotions came out. Basically what it is, is it's like a conditioner that you would use in your hair, but for your body. So after you use your shower gel, after you shower, you put this on your skin, you let it sit for a minute, and then you rinse it off. And then when I get out of the shower, instead of like wiping my body, I just kind of pat it with the towel, and my skin is already super moisturized. There's no need to put lotion on on top of it. Like it's just very, very hydrating your skin feels good and it just conditions your body hence the name body conditioner and it just like it lasts all day the scent lasts all day like I can't say enough good stuff about this you guys it is well worth the price okay well that is my kind of mini quick ish lush haul they have the cutest seasonal things they're gonna have Easter stuff soon I didn't pick up any of the Easter stuff last year or did I I think I picked up the egg balm I don't know but every holiday they have super cute things. They even have stuff for Father's Day and Mother's Day and just, I love Lush. So let me know what you picked up from this collection. Lush is an online store, so I'm gonna link all the products down below for you. Some of their stuff you cannot buy online because it's like fresh products, but everything here you should be able to buy online. So I'll link it all down below for you and I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you so much. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.